Juventus could sell the league this summer. I'm going to bring you the news and also give you my opinion on why I think this one might happen. What's up, everybody? Welcome back to IFTV. I'm Marco Messina. And if you're new here, make sure you subscribe if you love Serie A and speak English. Let's get straight into this news right now because there's breaking news from Di Marzio. I'm on our IFTV Instagram account. Di Marzio is saying that Chelsea are planning to offer Juventus 40 to 45 million plus Timo Werner in exchange for De Ligt. Again, Di Marcio, one of the more reputable sources in Italy, and he's not the only one. This morning, I woke up and I re was reading the newspapers, as I always do, and Repubblica and Corriere dello Sport were saying a lot of the same. We decided not to post it in the morning because we said, let's wait for someone more reliable to say it. But now that this news is coming out, let me tell you what Corriere was saying. They say, breakdown between De Ligt and Juventus. There is no agreement on reducing the salary, which is what Juventus wants, and there's no agreement on reducing the release clause from 115 million to 80 million, which is what De Ligt and his agent wants. De Ligt now wants to be sold, and Premier League clubs are interested in him. So, this is where we stand right now. If you would have said this a couple of months ago, People were talking about De Ligt becoming the future captain of the club when Chiellini left. He was seen as a symbol in the future, and now it seems like as they've been negotiating this extension, there has been doubts, in my opinion, from De Ligt's side. Because any player that is trying to lower his release clause, like that's part of their extension is to lower it, in my opinion, is sort of like a disbelief on the Juventus project going forward. It's a way out where Juventus next year are still not competing, are still not winning, trying to go far in the Champions League and at Serie A. It's his way out to make sure he has another out. But it seems like that tension is sort of brought into the summer and it could mean that the league leaves. The news that you're seeing right now, the, the 45, 40, 45 million, this is just what Chelsea is about to offer. Obviously does not mean that Juventus will accept this. In my opinion, that's absolutely crazy. And $45 million in cash plus Werner is a ridiculous offer for De Ligt, a player that was paid $70, $75 million, who was regarded as becoming one of the best center backs in Europe. He hasn't fully lived up to that potential, but he's still way too young to sell him for that low. And in my opinion, Juventus should still respect the release clause of what they have because if they did get $100 million plus, then you have room to buy a defender increase the quality in the midfield and up top. But I think it's really weird and really interesting on how things have developed. And of course, I want everyone's opinion down below because it's felt like, and I interviewed De Ligt, uh, about two months ago, back in like March, April, for, uh, for CBS, for, um, for, their, for CBS's coverage of Serie A in America. And my perspective when we were doing this interview and the feeling from Juventus's side, in my opinion, was that De Ligt was going to become the future captain of this team one day. He was seen as the new symbol, the, the guy that they were going to try to build and, and go forward with. And to think now that they could even separate the summer is pretty crazy turn of events. And personally, my personal opinion is that I think that this one, I, I, I can see De Ligt leaving this summer, not for the offer that is currently you know, being presented from Chelsea, but for something else, just because in my opinion, any player who is asking to reduce his release clause, it means that there's some sort of tension and some sort of lack of belief from their side and Juventus might have to cash in. What do you guys think is going to happen? What do you think should happen? Do you agree with this offer from Chelsea, by the way? Because let me go back to the comment section. There's people are, most of the people say that this is, would be a crazy offer and Juventus wouldn't be doing good. I know my boy Sia, Sia Vush, was saying that he thinks that Werner would tear up Serie A. So maybe you agree with Sia, but personally, I would never consider this from Juventus. There are some people that do say, great business for Juventus, fantastic deal. I, I don't know, I don't know. Where do you stand on this? What should Juventus do? Where, which side wants to leave? Is it more Juventus wanting to sell the league or the league wanting to leave Juventus? And do you see this one at the end of the day falling through and, and he could leave this summer and then who would be possible replacements? Guys, let me know. I uh, hope you enjoy this. Let me know if you like this quick reaction style. I'll make sure to do it. I have a lot of thoughts on my head from this move as 
you know, about a month ago, I started to see the signs that this one could happen. Uh, if you enjoy this, make sure you subscribe, like this video. We'll talk to you soon. Ciao ragazzi.